All right guys, so today I've been given a work order to hang this um, exhaust fan in the shower. Um, usually you can buy these from Bunnings um, and you can do it yourself really. Um, the, I guess by electrical standards and law, they are now uh, just a, a plug-in. So um, if yours starts to fail or gets clogged up, you can usually just replace it and there you go you can probably see it there um the three-way plug um so to hang this up well, that's come off easily great there's these plugs here these plugs sit on the side of the plaster now, this is really thick plaster let's oh, I see what's happened here They've popped two sealing um, Jiprox sheets on top of each other. Uh, okay. Anyway, so what we're going to do is have these facing inwards so they can get through the plaster wall that's already hung. Um, pop this through. And what you want to do, you've got to make sure that these are actually um, wide enough so they actually can fit because this is so thick make sure that's 20 mil thick so I might have to loosen these ones up so we get a bit more play so these um, levers actually are what hold the actual um, uh, housing of the fan, exhaust fan, into the thickness of the ceiling um, sheet. And you just rotate it and then, yes, yeah, start screwing them in. So this looks, well, I reckon what's happened. Well, I've seen what's happened. So that's one sheet there. And then this one needs to be a thick one, so this needs to be opened up a bit more. So there's one sheet here, and then there's two on these on these sides. So that short one needs to be put on that side. So I'll keep this one. doesn't have to be overly wide in this gap because there's only one sheet there. So, place them all like that. Looks like they've cut out grooves for it to fit in. And then I'm going to try and rotate it. Okay, so we don't need to rotate it. open. 
So when you rotate them, they'll actually um, pull the lever out and then that lever was like this and it'll pull out and it'll lock into the chip rock ceilings sheet. See, that's not falling out now. And then it's just a matter of putting this back on. And they've got some grooves that sit there. So just line them up and then rotate. That's it. And that's the job done. You just make sure she's running. Very good. And that's how you install an exhaust fan.